Good day, mates. Poke Dragon here, and welcome back to more of Let's Play Some More Time Spinner. In the last episode, we've got the breathing mask, which allows us to breathe underwater. And where's the relics? We got the we got the water mask, which allows us to breathe underwater. And hello, oh didn't see you before. Greetings, Todd. Have you come to worship the Eternal Mother? Who is that? Our goddess, the Eternal Mother. We are all her children. We decide when we live and when we die. When it's your time, may you greet her with your acceptance. And... Oh! It changed! Huh. The Eternal Mother. Maybe that's a bit of a difference they've just made in the past? Hmm. Who knows? Can I? Well, since we basically got the B key card, we can actually explore more of the Vanguard place. Oh, that's right. I need to get on the top of the bottom. Blech. But since we now have the double jump, we can now finally go to the right and see what's there. Another memory for Wachimi's son. I'm not going to view those anymore because they just take up a lot of time. Vanguard Metropolis. And what the heck is this place? Gold necklace, gold ring, essence necklace, another essence necklace, and some elemental beads, and who the heck are these guys? Must be part of the developer crew or something, I don't know. And we have an owl, along with the moonlight, Salem's memory, the moonlight lit. I guess the dog is part of the developer there for moral support. I don't know who those were. Yeah, we couldn't access those two areas from before. So how about we go back there and access those doors? Because we couldn't get to them before. Um, wait a minute. Is it the right way? Yep, I'm in. Yep, that's the right way. Go here, go over there, and... God, that still ear grating to my ear. Since we got the key card A in the last episode, we can finally open up those A doors. Thank you, Mr. Elevator. There we go. There's A. Oh, wait a minute. We don't even have A yet. That means the top one is B. There we go. That means you have something that we want. And up. And we have Bleakness Research. There we go. We finally got that quest out of the way. Bleakness Research. I knew I was missing something in How about we eat my laser? Alright. All we need is the A key card and we can finally go back. Alright, let's go back to the research again. Give that bleakness report to Nestelle, because I know she really wanted that. Here you go. Here's your research report. Hi, Lou. Did you find anything? It looked like they developed some treatments. Now I brought back everything I could find. Maybe it could help. But they never cured it. 
Over the years, it just got less and less deadly, I guess. That's unfortunate. Sorry. It's not your fault. You did everything you could. I'm sure that these notes will make it extremely useful. Thank you. Maybe we can use some help people. Use some help people. And it occurred to me, the symptoms are all about longing and quick tempers. And things, maybe that's what made the team so aggressive. They never got over the bleakness. I suppose that would make sense. Maybe it's not really their fault. They were just stranded here after all. They still made a choice now, but maybe it was on this end of a one. And we got finding a cure. And, um, let's see. What other quests do we have? We got two. Uh, oh, and it still has got another quest for us. No, hi. Hi, Linus. How are you? I'm good. I, I've been back to my time, and it looks like things I've done here in the team of my time has changed. Now, it's becoming weaker. And Galette, no change yet, but there's got to be a way. Wow, Lunas, you can change time, that's amazing. I know, it means I can really stop the team. I can save my family. But a thousand years of history, that's a lot to change. What are you saying? I have to do this. Of course, I'm just, I want you to be careful. I can't ask you to change more than you have to. Getting you and Faust, getting you and get treatments from the future and everything. It could have unwinded the consequences. Killing people now to save people in the future, that's got to be way better than a more peaceful way. I know, that's why I've left that Atlanta alive. Now, I think there's a, still a peaceful options. And Lechimi, you know, could still be, could make a better place. And maybe it starts by treating the bleakness from them now. Lechimi rulers have brought plasma pods from the creatures that radiate plasma. I bet they have some deep within the castle. If you bring me some, I could use them and information you gave me to synthesize a treatment. So it done. And what do you know? We just got plasma cores! <laughs> That's amazing! Thank you! I just started on the treatment right away. Lunas. Actually, Lunas, wait, before you go, I have something else to tell you. Oh? Sure. No, tell me everything. First, I want to thank you again, really. You've done so much for us here. You're welcome, now. I also wanted to finish telling you about my time in Galette. Hmm? I told you before that I didn't fit in with the army, but it wasn't just ideological differences. I was conscripted because of Galette, because of a Valenian man that expected to serve, and that's what they said I was. From the moment I was born, I didn't make sense to argue with them at the time. I had no idea things would be any different than I would desperately need to do. Then, like so many things of Alette, I eventually realized that they were ones who, who were wrong. When I left my army, I turned my life around, and I decided to help people, not fight for them. I reinvented myself, and I finally accepted the fact that I was a woman, embraced who I were, has been. Oh, now, thank you for telling me, and for trusting me. <laughs> you're welcome. The others know it too. I'm proud of my journey, but it can feel a little bit confessing sometimes. I feel like who I'm really telling. I want you to know now that this doesn't change how I feel about you. Aww. Good. That's good to hear. Estelle, you're one of the most amazing women I've ever met. The whole Valenian army could take that couldn't take that away from you. But that's not why I think you're great. It's your desire to make the world better for everyone and your determination to skill to actually do it. I should let you know I should let you work, but I'll be back later. Yes, of course. Take care now. Exotic imports. Oh, wow. <laughs> Can't believe we were over and done with that already. We have one more quest from Estelle. One more quest from Estelle. Let's see if others have any more quests for us to do, because... Wow, we got a lot of the... Oh, hello, we got two quests here. Hello. Hey, how are you feeling? Thumbs up for effort. <laughs> He's a brave one. He is barely alive and still fighting. What's that? Something to ride on? Hmm. Hmm? Cool for whatever. Siren ink. For a pen? Yeah, sure. Hey, why don't I give Ramada a break? He works so hard anyway. 
looking after this guy isn't so bad. How's he doing? He's a fighter, I can tell. The bleakness hit him hard, but he's not giving up. Sometimes I can't believe the Red would even send people here, knowing that the bleakness could do them. No wonder the Chim rebelled. I don't blame him. Look at this. I never wanted to fight in a war. It was just a job. Shoot, it's a good thing has Haracel's not around. She'd have my hide. Trenders talk like that. Tree just talk like that. How about a subject change, eh? We're running low on food again. I think we need some more substantial than bird legs. Then there were some wyverns in the caves last time I was down there. They're to territorial beasts, but they got some meat on them. Think you can take them on? Sounds like fun. I think we've already gotten them. Yep, we do. Here's your tails. <laughs> Not the Sonic character, just the actual tails. You got the Wyvern tails? Fabulous. You'll hear that. You hear that? One strength of Stormy Feast coming right up. Get some tail. <laughs> uh. All right. We haven't really well completed much of the quest. So how about we go back to the cabins? Because now with the water mask we have on, because now with the water mask that we have on, we can finally explore underwater in the in the cabins in the past. Because we couldn't do that before. I can't believe I got those quests out of the way early. <laughs> I wasn't ex uh, Very easy to. Very easy to complete quests in the game. Yep. So how we dive down, deep down, and go over here. And get more max sand. Nice. Something tells me we're about to get rid of them. Copper weapons. More herbs. Now we can finally explore underwater. We didn't do that before. Once over here, we get silver ore. Silver ore. Wait, wasn't there a quest that we need to do in regards to getting ores? Oh, plasma crystal from the caves. Well, since we got the water mats, we could finally see if we can get them. That's only one side of it. Ow. Hmm. Hmm. It seems um. Hmm. I think that's all we can do for right there for now. So I'm pretty much going to go back to this location over here since we have the water mask and now we can finally explore what's here though. And I'll remove that marker. So I'll be with you in a moment. I'm, I'm back to this pass here. 
I thought that while well, I'm pretty much on the way here, we can just explore the underwaters here because we didn't get the chance to. Because we now have the mask and. Yeah. Oh god, flesh eels. Uh, get out of here. God, they're long. But down here, we get elemental beads. Nice. And. And. Uh, god, slow movement. Caverns, nice. Let's see what's let's let's see what's around here. More max sand. Can't get wrong with that. Now we can finally explore that other place. God, now they're in the walls. There we go. More potions. Nice. Hippity hoppity, hippity hoppity. Get it. Move. Ow. Wow, you guys barely do any damage. Or creates deadly icicles on the ground. All right. Let's see what the ice orbs do. Find them. There we go. Let's let's check them out. Yeah. I'm gonna stick with the shadow orbs. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a necklace later on back at the store that. that, that is, I'm pretty sure there's gonna be a necklace back in the shells that. that will give us a lot more powerful ability later on. Ooh, hello. What's over here? Another herb. Ah! Fleshwater eel. Ugh. That is a lot to explore around here. I believe there should be another room. Oh, another cave entrance. What's over here? Oh, this brings us back to the caverns again. Okay. This is very interesting. 
We got more places to explore now. Alright, I think that's where we gotta call it an episode. I hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. Thanks for watching. I'm Poke Dragon, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Catch us later.